I'm so depressed I'm not cool, you know? Oh, hello, Eric. Hello. I guess we're playing some Hidden in Plain Sight today? Somebody might be loose in the building. So it's just regular Hidden in Plain Sight where one of my employees is hiding from me in my own building and I gotta find him and put him back to work, that whole thing? Mm -hmm. Okay. I wanna put this stuff down and then, then I'll start playing your little game. Oh boy. Looks like there's a clue already. You guys ruined a perfectly good product. These are my gum fries. You put real ketchup on them. That's gross. There's a note though. Okay, maybe I can find one that doesn't have ketchup on it. These are beautiful, they're gum fries. Mmm. I know, they got a crunch. It's chewing gum. It does look like legit. Let's see what the note says. Looks aren't everything, but to figure out where I am, you'll need to find a candy that's hidden in plain sight. So the person isn't in plain sight, the candy is. I'm coming in chaotic this time, y'all. Meet Dr. Chaos. The opposite of methodical. What would be more chaotic than not even looking? Instead, what I wanna do is go outside and play frisbee with Ben. <laughs> this is great. It's so chaotic. Is everyone reeling from the chaos yet? There is just so much productivity just going down the drain right now. I'm being chaotic and haphazard. It's the opposite of methodical. All right, I'm all frisbeed out. Well, I got a whole bunch of text messages while we were playing. Two from Daily. Your vet eats order has arrived. Contactless delivery to your desk, tip included. So Daily's hiding from me is what I'm guessing. I'm supposed to find candy hidden in plain sight. That feels boring. What's more chaotic? Let's just mess with everyone. Oh, it's Dr. Chaos! Oh, I'm gonna mess up their shoot. Get in the way. I'm being the opposite of methodical today. Just, just to clue you guys in, okay? He promised us all that we can go to Hurricane Harbor today. No, uh-uh. It sounds like a plan. It's not haphazard. Alexa, turn the house lights off! <laughs> See, I've created a bunch of chaos. Oh. oh, this could be a fun little poking stick. Get out of here. What now, Eric? The opposite of methodical is being inefficient. So that's why I'm gonna let Eric tell me what to do. I think you should go into the warehouse and go up to like Ed or somebody and proposed to them. That is haphazard. <laughs> oh Ed, boy. Here we go, Ed! Just for a minute. Ed, ah! it's happening, oh it's happening. God. Ed, would you do the honor of marrying me, Ed? <laughs> yes! He said, yeah, oh my gosh! It's the, it's the greatest day of our lives, Ed! It's our new life together. Wow. Wow, okay. I'm out of here. Who knew chaos could be so magical? What in the what Star the Wars heck? is going on in here? Why does he have the camera aimed right at the crotch of that stormtrooper? I mean, no one's hiding in here, right? I have a confession to make, Eric. <gasps> He's gonna propose to me. I don't like being haphazard and chaotic. No. My natural state is methodicalness. You can't fight your own nature. I just, I gotta be methodical. I can't help it. I can't be your Dr. Chaos anymore. Oh God, I feel so much better now that I'm being methodical again. Wait, she said something about looking for candy. So should I be methodically looking for candy? that's hidden in plain sight. That's gonna be tough because we have a lot of candy in this building. All right, I guess we're just looking for candy everywhere we go, just room to room, gotta clear them out. Oh man, there's so much good candy just sitting right here. Look at this, like new sour gummy worms. We gotta get back on track, Ben. Yeah, you find some more frisbee? <sighs> no, I couldn't do it. I'm back to being methodical again. What are those personality types that's like lawful, good? Okay, I found a Star Wars one. You were being, I would say, chaotic neutral. That's Han Solo. Okay. But yeah. we established that you're not chaotic. You're lawful neutral. Okay, okay who's that? C-3PO. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that dude's such a dork. You're killing me here. Oh man, you got the dud. Can you do a good 3PO? Eric, what should we do now? <laughs> Is that good? Come on, Eric, we're going to be methodical. I'm so depressed I'm not cool, you know? Stop me if you've heard this before, but we are gonna be methodically looking. Where would Daily be? There's like three or four places where we keep candy. Oh, there's some giant five pound gummy bears just sitting out. But she said, if I find the candy hidden in plain sight, I'll find her. Maybe I should go to places where you wouldn't keep candy, like our shop. I'm gonna stop looking for actual candy, but maybe 
representations of candy, like in literature or music. Like in Mandy Moore's 1999 hit song, Candy, Eric's childhood crush. This is where you can do the whole like dance number, right? For this track, you know? What I'm finding out is I'm easily distracted. What are these two doing out of their editing cages? They're never out and about. This is such a clue. Oh my gosh. You guys. <laughs> I don't know what it means that Kelsey and Ariel are together out of their office. Are they helping Daly? Daly, I got a message. It's the same message as from before. <gasps> so those two just left something in my office. Oh, they're definitely helping Daly. Oh, you've been in my office, huh? No, you're in Emma's office. Not true. Uh-oh, another clue! This looks delicious. Can you believe it's been 26 episodes? It's not a stretch to say the last 25 have been fun. So in this clue, they've shoehorned the word stretch in there. It's gotta figure out how that relates to candy. That looks like gummy hot dog and beans. That's weird. Yeah. <laughs> Let's look at our clues, folks. But to figure out where I am, you'll need to find a candy and then stretch. Stretch is so odd. It doesn't make sense. Look at all these great products in here. Just look at them. I feel like I found like a new poking stick though, Eric. <laughs> Give me a clue, Emma. Give me a clue. <laughs> Kelsey, where's Daily hiding? You seen anything out of the ordinary? I'm not. See your betrothed. Where's Ariel at? Kelsey's not in her office anymore. They're dropping something off at my desk right now. I just know it. They must be. Oh gosh, not this again. These two are thick as thieves, these two. Gosh. I told you, these two. That is a legitimate thing. It's still too convenient, you know? I just. Dude, you gotta shut your buddy up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll put him away. It would be crazy if Daly was like hiding in her own office. You know, is she like down under there? No. I'm just looking for like candy somewhere in plain sight. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, come on. these two. Come on with you two. This is crazy town. They're so suspicious. We just got a text message from Daly. They put another order on my desk. Why you always gotta run? Don't run. We got another clue, folks. Eat up, you're on a tear. I think that's milk with Fruit Loops. Mm. Oh, Fruit Loop gummies are good. I got it. You know what looks like candy, but isn't? and you can stretch it and tear it? Crazy Aaron's putty. I have a couple of them over there. He's got that sensory putty. It smells like candy. Scoopberry, it's scented like ice cream. And he's got this one, gumballs. You can stretch it, which was in one of the clues, the word stretch, and you can take this stuff and you can tear it. I got it, I know where she's hiding. We have a big tin of putty up front. I bet you Daly's inside of it. Stretch, tear. Last year we made an amazing putty video and one of the things we did was make a giant tin of it. Perfect size for a Daly to fit in. I think Daly is in here somehow. Hello? Daly? Okay, she's not in there. I still think putty is the clue. I'm getting close, guys. I'm getting close. Yeah, I think I'm figuring it out. I think this is Scoop Berry. Oh gosh, yeah. Just how does this connect to where she's hiding? We also have these giant barrels full of putty in the warehouse. Is she in one of these barrels, dudes? Come on, come on. Okay, that's just, that's just a bunch of putty. Daily! Really thought I was onto it there. Come on, come on. What else that we sell? that we put into videos where we're like, it stretches and it tears. Like, I can't think of anything other than putty. Come on! Where'd you get a bat? <laughs> Got myself a bat. This is a good poking stick, though. Ariel's not in there. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Every time, these two, they're You're supposed to- the tour. Yeah, no. Now. Sure. We really were just doing the tour. Hey, real quick, name a product that Van 19 sells that is uh, that stretches and tears. Putty? I rest my case. The clue is taking me to Putty Town. I got nothing right now. Okay, the other thing this could be, right, is like a grilled cheese sandwich. I don't know what that's a clue to, like in the kitchen. 
next to the toaster or something. I mean, I can't get beyond stretch and tear. I'm getting upset. I feel like I'm being punked. Okay, where is she for crying out loud? Dude, it's gotta be something to do with putty. I just know it. But I'm gonna look back there. I'm telling you, this whole video has to do with putty. Look, he's suddenly playing with putty. This is gonna be in your little rewind thing, and it looks like you're playing with the hide and side one. Sweet surprise! You were not holding this earlier. This is supposed to be a clue for candy. 33 minutes, here we go. You think it's literally candy? It might literally be candy. Is this candy hidden in plain sight? Yeah, 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 yeah. Dude, Santa's not even recording anything anymore. He's just, he's just dragging the camera like, like this bat. Just to... They've dropped another clue, okay. Oh. That's looking. Oh. That's looking oh, rough. It stinks. What is that? Oh. That's like tuna and mac and cheese. Oh. Grab some comfort food, you'll bounce back. It's another putty clue. I get it guys with the putty. Which putty are we talking about? I'm not eating this. Okay, I'll eat a little bit of it. Well, oh. stretch, bounce, tear, that's putty. But come on, come on. Putty's such a clue. How is it tied in? Like, why are you giving me putty is such a giant clue. Why are you giving me the putty? Is there somewhere put where putty is all the time and I'm just like completely forgetting about it? I mean, there's the big bouncy putty ball. I feel like I've looked everywhere we have putty. I will tell you this, Jamie. I think you've seen the ultimate clue. <gasps> I've seen the ultimate clue. I'm sure it's gonna be super obvious when you guys say it to me, but I'm not getting it. I'm coming back to this. Is that? Scoop berry. Scoop berry, huh? Yes, yeah, scoop berry. Huh. Scoop berry. Scoop berry, huh? Mm. You got any uh, more of that around anymore? Do we? Other than the warehouse, you have no idea where else we could have some putty. Where else is putty? Where else is putty? Where else is putty? Every room in the building, that's where. This is normally where it would be. Right here. It's out of stock. Oh my gosh, where else could it be? You keep trying to tell me other places. I don't know. Where else do we see it today? Any other putty. Anywhere else. I only have a few minutes left and I have no idea where we have more scoop berry. You guys are laying it on so thick. Seems I like there was somewhere we were a lot of times today. What are they talking about? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't know what you guys are talking about. Putty? Smelling, some stretching. Smelling? What? I'm so close. I know it. Oh, I still have 27 seconds. Where's the putty candy? We're laying it all thick. I don't know what putty stuff you're talking about. Oh man, I just ran out of time. Uh, Jamie, maybe you should take us back to where you demoed the scoop berry and the other putties for Santa and I. You mean in my office? <gasps> At Fat19, we sell a lot of candy. That's not always what it seems. That's what gave us the inspiration for this episode. We created our own disguised candy, telling Jamie exactly where I am in the kitchen cabinets, which are also not what they seem. In order to make the perfect hidden plain sight clue, we turned chocolate into putty. So where was this covert candy? It was on his desk the whole time, disguised as a tin of candy scented putty. That's why we kept luring him back to his desk with food. He even picked up the tins right next to it. He's got that sensory putty. It smells like candy. It was right there. Putty's such a clue. How is it tied in? He did figure out the clues pretty quick, which is that they're based on what we say in our putty videos. Stretch it, bounce it, tear it. Plus, we gave Ben a tin of sweet surprise hide inside putty because there was a sweet surprise hiding inside the candy putty. But he didn't quite get it. You're one bite away from finding me, Jamie. I mean, I had putty here. Is it like on the putty somewhere? Did you guys do something to my desk? I have putty on this desk all the time. This was the big clue? A tin of putty? You're getting close. This one, it's like made out of chocolate. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Can I eat this putty? Dang, oh, look at that. It says kitchen cabinets on this clue. Kitchen cabinets? Dang it, I've looked in there before. I didn't think anybody could fit inside of those cabinets. Oh, Daily, how long have you been in here? Poor thing. 
No. No. To hell with you guys. Hey, there he is. Oh, if you would just let me be methodical, <laughs> I would have looked in here. What's up, Daisy? Hi, Daily. <laughs> Dang it! Yeah, I see that. Oh my goodness. That <laughs> get back to work. That is a cool picture. Who made the tin of putty? Emma. Emma made that? That was cool. If Emma made the tin of putty, that like what did you really do? I provided moral support and entertainment. <laughs> okay. Bye. Good day. Yeah, great. Yay. Bye. Mmm. I think it's just fudge. Tastes Maybe like it's just straight chocolate. Tastes like success. Okay. Batnine.com